Hey, <clears throat> this is the Boat Doctor. Down here, Big Jim, nice and pretty. Hey, out here in the 2023 Hughescraft 210 Sea Runner. OR 777777HHW. I might have said HH, but it's AHW. Top size backdrop. You got a tower, Hoosecraft. An arch, whatever you want to call it, net holder, gap holders, pole holders. You can put a radar. They already got the pad up top, so you can mount a radar up there. I would probably suggest that. I use radar mainly in the daytime. A lot of times, put it on an overlay. There you go. Got a nice deck, horn, window stop, wiper, dual. Got an Altera Minnesota. And it's a manual deploy, which is good. They release really easy. I take this off. You don't, I wouldn't do that, but I do it. So I'm a hypocrite. And it needs a brake cap. Brake fluid is good, two inch ball. Standard flip, spare tire. Got a little bit of a reverse outside shine. Keeps that water down. Keeps it a little bit more stable. Gear bath oil hubs, brown good, white bag. Hey, no pun intended. I uh, got discs. All four <clears throat> dual axle <clears throat> diamond plate up on the top cap <clears throat> so you, when you step on you don't scratch the top you know I always wonder why they painted the top <clears throat> they could paint up here if they wanted to but back here I just bedline all this or with a non-skid now I don't know if this guy is trading for a new boat or something I think he is but he took everything out everything there's all, so they got to either mount new pole holders because over there you see the holes in the back you see which is okay that's where you get to mount pole holders anyway and then he had a hole back there <clears throat> so i don't know if he ran some wires uh, for downriggers which i think he did because that he even took those out so that must have been his downrigger plugs is what they were because if he has one on this side which he does and that's what they work fish box inspection caps to the fuel tank gutter system water goes in goes back here goes into your bilge which is good some have made it so tight you couldn't get water out of the deck <clears throat> battery switch over there you step anywhere on the trailer that's perforated like this that's the strong part trim tabs and <clears throat> back here you had a kicker motor you can see took that off i think he had autopilot if i remember right the pumps in here but he took but that makes me wonder though if you think about it i'm gonna look at that because if that's a pump that pumps for the main right here because on if it's an autopilot for the kicker the motor is on the bracket anyway so that autopilot might be for the main but he took it as display off so you'd he want us to see if he puts new electronics in here whoever buys this boat they want to go garment and go to the 72 or 8600 series you got 15 pitch aluminum 200 inline port zincs internally every cylinder on the block zinc down there zinc up underneath here two coats of clear two coats of primer zinc there bars those are the good ones his transducer was here it looks like it that was a garmin 51 he even took the clamshell here uh, that's above the water line. The water line's here, but if you backed up, it would go inside. Sea <clears throat> Star Hydraulic, your trim switch, switch right here. And then you got your P hole right here for the water. It's a 2023 heavy duty strap eyes, shine guides. Nice, nice. Then you're going to step here. Come on in. Get this up yep got a live well that there with the holes in it that's to get slow the water down so it doesn't slosh over the top of this it's like a baffle and this is for the fish box which is here and there was that other hole i was telling you so this is where his downrigger plugs were right here and that'd be about right because it'd slide in here and you'd have the nut on the back side that's for the live well but when you hit this one you got to have the front on as well so that works that's your uh, wash down. Here's for your battery charger to plug it in. 
I don't think he used it a heck of a lot out in the water. It don't look like it. And if this, if you take the hose off, you either want to make sure you put that cap on or turn this off, because if not, water is going to come in by itself. And then take this off. Insulated fish box. Yeah, see, there's the autopilot pump there. There's